Hello YouTube, I'm Julia and welcome to my channel. As we know, we're all really bored in quarantine and it's summer, so here's 20 things to do in quarantine. First off, read a book. I'm currently reading Best Love Fairy Tales by Hans Christian Andersen and it just includes a bunch of classic fairy tales and their original versions. Next, go through your photo album. It takes a while, but it's actually really entertaining to look at a bunch of random photos you took like five years ago and you'll have way more storage. The third thing to do is draw. This is just a poorly drawn cat I drew for demonstration. The next thing you can do is stretch. I don't know about you guys, but I've been getting really inflexible lately, so I've just been stretching and feeling better, and it's just really good for you, so. The next thing you can do is write. Me and my friend have been writing a series of short stories, and it's just been really fun and a great productive way to pass time and get better at writing. The next thing you can do is go online shopping. Even if you don't get anything, it's just fun to scroll through and get some outfit and spill. The seventh thing you can do is take a nap. Quarantine has totally messed up like most of our sleep schedules, so why not take a nap while you have the chance to? Eighth thing you can do in quarantine is work out! Another thing you can do is experiment with new hairstyles and just see what you can do. The next thing you can do is play dress up. You can plan and experiment with outfits for back to school or just for fun, but either way, it's a great time, especially if you have someone to do it with. The lovely thing you can do is study. Become smarter. You can also play with your pet, unless he clearly doesn't want to play with you like Sheldon here. Become TikTok famous. Another thing you can do is FaceTime a friend. In this case, I'm facing my sister because I have no friends, but she's not answering. So this is me telling her to answer, and she still doesn't answer. Two hours later. Anyways, FaceTime a friend is a fun and easy way to consume time. You can also binge watch TV, and so far I've watched Rain. Finished Grey's Anatomy, which literally took me a year. Season four of Riverdale, which was honestly kind of weird and re-watching Once Upon a Time for the third time because it will always be one of my all-time favorites. Another thing you can do is rearrange the stuff in your room. I just added some fairy lights and photos and tons of stuff in the wall. You can also rearrange furniture and it just feels like a whole other room. The next thing to do is go on a walk. It's just a great way to breathe, exercise, and see nature. You truly have nothing to do, just hang out with your built-in friend, your sibling. Nothing like that sisterly love. Become a YouTuber. We have so much time on our hands in summer break in quarantine, and if I can do it, so can you. 